bass, the sound of that bass, I find incredible. Let's look at that one. I'm going to take a little bit of the sound here. Just a bit. Since that's made no difference by putting this back in. Does it make a difference taking the plectra off? There's the plectra off, so that's just the of earth. Why does it stick afterwards? No, take the of earth off and put the eight foot on. On and why should that be? I have no Maybe idea. Maybe you use double the strength to get a flexor over the strings. It's because they're both lifting and therefore mm. um, the sliding is being um, the, sli the sliding. They're hindered. not sliding off the. Yeah, sliding is being hindered. Very odd. Intriguing? Yeah, the intriguing part is sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Yes. And uh, makes me want to push it through the floor. No, I know, I know. Um, I'm wondering if it ought to be uh, a greater touch depth. Because it's very it's quite shallow. How does it compare to the other harpsichords? Um, I don't know. Should we go and see? Um, I think it's quite shallow. The thing is, if you, put, if you make it deeper, it's, that you tend to get sticky notes. Probably with the manufacture of the holes that the pins go through, the locating pins go through. Mm. But the Perturbuff and the Plectra, I think, is a very interesting combination. Mm. But it might be, perhaps it's, does, it doesn't work with the... Uh, I know, perhaps, is, is that a problem with just with the Perturbuff? There's per, Perturbuff as it is. That's... I know the bottom manual we've got a problem with.
Fantastic. <laughs> Great fun. So the front rail pushes on with three pins. It was pinned and glued. It might give us more problems than that. And this rail here goes on to two screws which go into the two slots there on the other side. And I probably can't do it with the camera in one hand and this in the other, but that's where they go. It just does help to line it up. Voila! That's wonderful. And then oh, this... No, it came off. No. Wait a minute. It has to go again. there. Yeah. And this one is providing us with extra entertainment. Yes, yeah, Max, could you um, push this down as I push it down this side? It just goes down... Straight down. And that could be a problem. It's not responding. It's do it from the middle. Unresponsive. Uh, no, it, it's that. Oh, I see. Oh. It's a challenge. Have you got it there? So this is the last job to be done with a 14 pound hammer. Perhaps it's in your I think we're there. That's it. Done. Michael, thank you very much for your help. <laughs>